Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for our main event, and yes, I have been here tonight. Just been preparing for this match. Because, hell, you're getting me right now, right at the beginning of this, as our robotic version of Lillian Garcia is announcing to the fans this matchup. And here, folks, comes the number one contender getting his rematch for the championship here tonight, Alexander Ertz. He has been dead set on this rematch, folks. He wants to get his OGW title, his words, not mine, back into the fold, back into the kingdom, and continue on his quest to bring all the championships into the kingdom. Of course, he's going to have to defeat the man that defeated him at Leg Apocalypse, DC Radia, folks. But Alexander put up one hell of a fight in that three stages of hell match. So many times DC Radia had to hit him with the shots fired. But here tonight, folks, you can see the confidence on Alexander's face. In his mind, he is only one, two, three. Palm of the hand strikes to the mat before he gets his championship back. And now, folks, let's get our wait. What, folks? I'm uh, I'm hearing some reports that something's going on in the backstage area. Can can we get a camera back there? Is it, is it possible to get a camera into the back? Something is going on. Okay, folks, I, I'm, I'm getting worried that we are going to be cutting to the back here now. And oh my god! That cyborg beard, he's attacked DC Radia just before he could come out onto the stage. DC Radia taking him down here now, but oh my god, folks, what, what does this mean for our main event here tonight? This assault. Last week we heard that cyborg beard had something planned for this week. Many of us just assumed it was the tag team contest we had earlier in the night where the Canadian Connection successfully retained the tag team titles against the machines. You see Radia now throwing Cyborg Beard into that garbage can. Folks, do you see Radia now waiting? Oh! Cyborg Beard rolling out of the way, but do you see Radia catches him and throws him right into that traveling suitcase. Oh, and hits him again. And a reverse power slam there. Oh, but Cyborg Beard with a metal elbow right to the face. Going for a neck bar. Oh, DC Radia right into the mechanical parts. Looks like I, I can't believe it. I... Our main event, our main event here tonight, the biggest rematch in OGW history has just been ruined by the machines here, or at least by Cyborg Beard. And DC Radia has him up, folks. Oh, that Cyborg Beard fighting his way out of the shots fired into a reverse atomic drop. And now Cyborg Beard throwing DC Radia into the wall, knocking over those boxes. Now picking him back up. And again now, who throwing him into the gorilla position. And folks, I'm getting word here now that Alexander Ertz is in the ring. He is irate about this. He wants his championship rematch here tonight, but... I'm not sure if we're going to have it now with this happening. Oh, big elbow drop there from DC Radia. The champion showing his strength here tonight, fighting back against this disgusting backstage attack. And there's Eat Defeat. Now DC Radia waiting for Cyborg Beard to get back up. He's got him. But again, Cyborg Beard fighting out of it. DC Radia. Unable to hit his finisher. Oh, oh my god. Folks, when you get thrown like that, how many PSI of power is just Cyborg Beard using? And again, whacking DC Radia's face off of that trunk. Now he's got him back up. Big clothesline. Oh, but he's hanging on. 
pick him back up again and hits him with another clothesline. He's still holding on, folks. And a third clothesline. Wait, what? Folks, I, I know our camera's still back here, but there's a rumbling out here in the crowd, I'm being told. So something's going on in the ring area. But our, our cameras are still focused back here. I'm, I'm hearing our tech crew is having a little bit of an issue trying to get our uh, camera back into the ring. A sidewalk slam there from Cyborg Beard just springing right back up to his feet at the same time. Oh, big elbow shot. Oh, folks, I, I, I've heard our cameras about the switch. Oh, what a neckbreaker by Cyborg Beard. And now just taunting the champion. Shouting at him. Okay, folks, our camera's ready to go back to the ring. And oh my god, folks, in the ring, the other two members of the machine, Cyborg Sam and Cyborg Mike, are attacking Alexander Ertz. And Ertz now fighting back, folks. Oh, taking down Mike Chalice. But Sam Landry right back at him. And folks, I'm also getting word that also in our backstage area, apparently. Mechos and Mini Mech Mayhem, both of whom we saw at Light Apocalypse, are attacking Abel Almighty and Marcos, preventing them from coming out of, to the ring. We have no idea where Lord X and Izzy are. Uh, one can only assume that the machines have been attacking them as well. And I, I guess our ref is confused because he's going for a pen attempt there. This is not an official sanctioned match, folks. The machines must have some kind of mind control on our referee as well. Oh, big splash there. Driving a forearm right into the face of Alexander. Mike now hitting the ropes. Sam picking up Alexander, but Alexander, folks, continues to fight back. Mike now throwing him into the corner. Oh, Alexander ready for him, though. Oh, and whoo, Cyborg's had miscalculated there, taking down Mike. But he's got Alexander, throws him into the other turnbuckle now. Mike going right back out and setting him up to the top rope. Oh, Alexander fighting him away. Diving! Oh, and missed. Folks, it, it looks like we are not going to get a championship match here tonight. Um, I'm... I'm waiting. I, I can see a couple of my uh, co-workers here. They're on the phone talking right now, folks, to the higher-ups, talking to the OGW general manager, and hopefully I'll have some news for you here shortly. Sam now setting up for that big dropkick. Oh, but Mike interrupting it, and Sam, I guess, it, that did not compute, and he just fell right on his back. Oh, and again, diving in, folks. This is not good for Alexander being double teamed here by two members of the machines. It's Sam now. Got him ready. Folks, this is this is insane. There it is, the big powerful drop kick into a corner. Oh god, I don't know how much more of this I, I can even stand to watch. I mean, there's only at near the beginning of the year here, folks, where we saw that insane feud between Lord X and Alexander, where Lord X came out and brutalized him, but this this could be even worse, folks, as this is a two-on-one thing against two merciless machines who took out one of the most popular face teams here in OGW, Gaming Leg. And now are these disastrous monsters in Alexander Art. He hits the creative differences on Cyborg Sam, but Cyborg Mike is right there with a back body drop. This is this is just not fair, folks. This is not fair at all. But Alexander continues to fight back. And I'm getting word in the backseat area that DC Redia is DC Redia is trying to fight back as well against Cyborg uh, Beard. But apparently, Mechos has gotten involved in that fight as well. And oh my god! What a German suplex, folks. Alexander continuing, folks. 
continuing to try and fight back against these two. Throwing Mike there into that exposed turnbuckle. And again, <laughs> trying to break apart the machine. Now Alexander going for a pin here, folks, realizing very quickly that it's pointless. This is not a match. Trying again. And now Mike, folks, continuing to fight. Sam now has Alexander and another perfect flawless German suplex. Folks, the fans don't even know what to do here. I think they're booing the machines just because they thought they were getting uh, the rematch of the century here tonight, but instead are getting this mauling of the number one contender and champion. Sam now going back to that top rope. Diving off with an elbow. Alexander throwing Mike into the corner, but Mike fighting back again. He's got him up. Oh, and lays him down, and that just busted Alexander open, folks. That head wound of his, not even healed from leg apocalypse. Oh, and it looks like Cyborg and Mike, folks, is charging up in the corner. Getting a two came there for whatever reason. Again, this is not a sanctioned match. Oh, and there's the leg spike. Or I don't even know what it's called right now. It used to be the leg spike from Mike Chalice. The referee almost getting a three count there. Mike getting ready again to hit that, but Sam steps in instead. Oh, and now Alexander taking down Mike. But Sam was right there waiting. Sam now setting Alexander on that top rope. Could he be looking for that devastating outside suplex? Mike instead steps in. And there's the double underhook superplex. And now Cyborg, Mike, folks, waiting for him. Oh, but Alexander was ready and takes down Mike. But Sam picks him up. Oh, and there's the detonation kick. And again, another pin attempt here by the machines. One, two, and Alexander kicks out. I might as well just start calling this like a regular match, folks, if they're going to keep doing this. Wait a minute. Maybe this referee has been programmed as well, ladies and gentlemen. I never even thought about that. We're going to have to possibly get that checked for next week as well. Oh, Samoan drop from Cyborg Mike. Alexander fighting back against one, but there's always a second machine awaiting. And Alexander now being driven into Cyborg Mike, and Cyborg Mike takes him and jams him into that exposed turnbuckle. Oh, wait, folks, I finally have some word about uh, my co-workers here on the phone with the higher-ups. The OGW general manager, she will have an announcement about this happening this Friday on Friday Night Fight after our uh, Friday Night Fight championship match between, I believe, Alpaca and Michael Huber. So after that match, expect to hear from our OGW general manager what is going to happen in regards to the machines the Kingdom and the YouTube Bullet Club folks. Or I should say more specifically between Alexander Ertz, DC Verdaya, and the Machines. I'm sure that will be a ground breaking announcement come Friday night. Just look at this folks. Oh my god. They are not stopping at Oh, this this is this has been going on for way too long now. Can we please get somebody out here to stop this? Where is the rest of the locker room, folks? They should be out here now trying to break this up. What? Wait, that? When did we get 
cyber locks on the doors. Well, folks, apparently backstage we have cyber locks on the doors and the machines have programmed them to stay locked and nobody can break down the doors. Apparently human metal and whammy time have been both trying to open up one of the locker room doors, but it ain't budging and they're trapped inside while this is happening. Oh, big elbow drop there from Cyborg Mike. Folks, I, I, I honestly don't know what... Oh my god, and a double feet to the face. This is just insane, folks. These outside, these are outsider outsiders, folks. Alexander Arch, what I was talking about, non-outlaws in OGW. But this is a step further. And again, into a pin attempt, folks. Oh my god, and a diving splash from Sam there. Machines working in tandem with one another. Alexander Arch, folks. Looks like he's trying to distract them enough, but there's no stopping these two. And another light spike there, and Sam going down. One, two, three. No, Alexander Ertz kicking out again, folks, in this non-sanctioned matchup. Folks, we, we gotta get some info about this referee. We have definitely have got to have a new referee next week. To call things fair. Oh, this is this is just brutal, brutal, insane. And it looks like oh, big inside Gurry there from Mike. It looks like they're finally cooling off, folks. They're just chucking Alexander out of the ring right now. All the replay is going on, folks. Uh, I I am just I I I think we we are done here for the night. Just. Let's try and cool our heads and see what happens this coming Friday night when our OGW general manager will have an announcement to make. And as always, folks, good night and good fight. <laughs>